Hello, this is Michelle Knight. This is the astrological update for Cancer for the week starting the 13th of January. And now, do you want the good news or do you want the challenging news? Let's start, as the week does, with the slightly challenging news. However, I have to say, out of all the signs, yours is slightly less challenging than other people's with this particular cardinal grand cross that is occurring. Yes, you heard me correctly, a cardinal grand cross. However, we do end the week with a mystic rectangle, so don't panic yet. Anyway, this cardinal grand cross is echoing some of the themes around Christmas, some of the challenges around the end of the year that you've already been experiencing. Even Kiki's going, I can't cope, I need to hold on to my puppy. And, uh, you may feel similarly. You may think, I'm going under the duvet because I can't make a decision. However, the good news is that your ruler, the moon and Jupiter are conjunct in your sign. So whatever happens this week, there's an element of good fortune. Even if things seem challenging, you should be able to get something out of it, if not now, but in the future. For you, it's really all about the fact that you want to spread your wings. You want to evolve. Perhaps an opportunity arises for you, but... It throws a cat among the pigeons when it comes to your career or what other people feel about you. There's lots of transformation in your relationship or your idea or your energy connected to relationships. And that's something Cancerans don't normally applaud or enjoy. However, as I say, Jupiter wants you to be happy. Jupiter is making you grow and Jupiter is bringing you some good fortune and your ruler is cheering you on. The T-square that happens on the 15th also is again, it's almost like, you know, there's a part of you that may be tempted to let your insecurity stop you doing that next step, which you know is vital to your growth and happiness. So be brave, be a warrior. On the 15th also, we have Saturn trining the moon and Jupiter in your place of pleasure. So whatever is occurring, that is, again, the opportunity for happiness and happiness needs to be your guide. Finally, we have a mystic rectangle. No, we don't. What am I talking about? Something even more important. Finally, nearly finally, we have a full moon in your sign. Happy days. Your ruler is filling you up with energy and power and emotion. It will be intense. You should have intuitions. You should have dreams. You should be feeling creative. But you'll also know the truth to whatever question you're asking. And finally, finally, we have a mystic rectangle, which is delivering you, thanks to the moon, some fabulous news about your future or even present abundance. And also, you're just feeling very secure, particularly around your home and family, and there could be some good news connected to your career. Happy days. Take care, and I'll speak to you soon.